At Gooding Elementary, we have opportunities to grow as teaching professionals. These opportunities consist of observations from our peers and administrators through instructional rounds. Instructional rounds are completed on a monthly basis. During these rounds, there are administrators and teachers from our high school, middle school, and elementary school. During those rounds, a specific strand of the Charlotte Danielson model is focused on. These instructional rounds are conducted because we feel that there are teaching techniques to be learned from every teacher in our district. In addition to instructional rounds, our instructional coach leads many learning rounds with beginning or new to the district teachers. These focus on routines, behavioral management, and intervention strategies. In addition to instructional rounds, we also had a response to intervention or RTI training. In this training, we received an overview of the RTI process. Each grade level team discussed how they were involved in the RTI and what next steps needed to be taken. In conjunction, we participated in a Play-Doh training. In this training, we were able to discover how to use Play-Doh data to aid our daily instruction. This year, we have also had the opportunity to learn more about the technology available to us in our district. This year, we were fortunate enough to have projectors and mimeos installed in our classroom, as well as two sets of clickers for our building. During our professional development days, we took the opportunity to learn how we can integrate these technologies to enhance the learning of our students. These technologies are used to add excitement to the lessons being taught. Teachers have found the Mimeos to be useful for aiding in the instruction of all areas of teaching. The clickers have renewed the student's ambition for success. With immediate feedback, the student learners are eager to do their best to answer each question correctly. Through this feedback, students are able to make connections to previous instruction. With this individualized feedback available to the teachers on student achievement, individual student needs are quickly assessed. Here at Gooding Elementary, we are always looking for areas of improvement. We have had and continue to have opportunities to learn how we can better meet the needs of our students to enhance their performance.